called the Schmino, and it was originally designed and for salt water, but um, I use it in ponds and rivers, and it works just beautifully. And it's another one of those material, those simple three materials. You're done. Okay. So. Okay. So the secret to this fly is this stuff. It too comes in various crystal chenille or things, something like that, right? And the guys who, who invented this, a fellow down in, in uh, Florida, and basically when he goes fishing, saltwater fishing down there, this is the only fly he fishes with. Mm -hmm. so you don't need anything else. It just works. And when I saw the pattern, I went, why aren't we using this? <laughs> this has to work, right? So, start our thread. And I don't know if they, I think you should probably use a white thread. Am I uh, slightly off there? OK. I'm always a little off, anyway. Yeah. Um, you've seen these. I know you have. Um, Mono eyes, right? Okay. These are the large ones, and you sort of put them not exactly too close to the front, but in the front part. Oh, maybe that's what it is. Okay. Would bead chain work for this, or you need? You could use bead chain. Okay. I've used uh, small weighted eyes. You know, any, anything like that. That's. It's, it's one of those be? One of those. This, of course. Everyone should have a little bit of this. Just make sure you don't get yourself with it. Yeah, naturally it just pours out. All right, that's not going to be good. That's true. Oh, God. That's going to get me. I just know it. Yeah, the glue is uh, trying to get me. Yeah. All right, there we go. Okay, and then you get a. I like it normally. I usually put this in a spool or something. Of some sort. Anyway, um, then you just tear a little bit there at the end. Tie it in. Okay, you guys have been watching this, right? Because this is really complex and complicated. <laughs> <laughs> you know that. Complex and complicated, right? Bring that up to the front here and then. Okay, as you you should just try and stroke it back a little bit here, so and this this by this ah sugar. Found the super glue. And I'm sorry I rushed it because the super glue was out to get me. Trim. Tie it off. And that is it, folks. Okay? Fish it on a sinking line or a sink tip. Anything like that. That is it. Done. How much more simple can that be? The first time I went and used these, even I was embarrassed. <laughs> That's it. That's the whole thing. It's called a schmino. You can buy, you know, this stuff is stupid price, like six, seven dollars or something for a hank of this, but you're going to tie an awful lot of flies out of it. Um, some of us have learned how to make our own mono eyes. <laughs> 
buying them is ridiculous, but um, you could do it if you had to. And um, or you could use uh, lead eyes. You could use um, those little um, eyes like this. See, eyes like that. Anything like that. That adds a little weight, which makes it a little awkward to cast. But and the first time I put this on at a certain club that Brian might be familiar with, mm -hmm. I went through five of them, I think, in an afternoon, just torn to rat shit. And I've used them in Is stream that just trees. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> And I've used them, they actually work in rivers as well. Mm -hmm. And they're just a nondescript mineral pattern. Mm -hmm. So all it is. shrimp in the middle. Yeah, shrimp. That's right. Mm -hmm.